Hey guys, I just want to give you guys an update um, on the Vintage Logo course. Thank you for uh, watching that and just um, I hope you're enjoying that course um, as I went through it. Um, but recently on uh, something that I didn't add to that course because um, I didn't have it yet and also because the Vintage um, app design has been, they've been doing updates like probably every week. For the past month or so uh, and so after I already made that course for you guys so I want to show you a couple things I actually bought the vintage pro and so what the vintage pro is it's $24 for one year and pretty much you get access to all of these templates that they have here so all the templates that you see here um, you get access to them and so what's really cool about this you might think well I don't want to I don't know how to use I don't want to use these templates I want to make my own designs but here's the cool thing about it is that um, you can use these templates and all you have to do is plug in your words and it'll make your design for you so um, if you just think about that so just for an example here I'm just gonna show you this is what they have right here these are all the new ones that came out this week um, if you saw my um, you saw my uh, the title, the thumbnail, and how I did for um, the course. You'll so, you'll see that I use this one right here, and I, I this was this is brand new. It just came out. So all you need to do is come over here and push explore, and just click it a couple times, and then you could change it. You'll see. You'll remember earlier I changed it. Um, I put iPhone in there because I did the iPhone thing, but then in here I just did uh, you know. apps course right there and so you'll you'll see that it just fills it out so you can use it for yourself you know you can use um you know I did a video earlier today over Alaska so you could change this to Alaska and you could just um, you could just put is you know is calling Alaska is calling so there there's you a design already you might say well that's not you know I want to change some more stuff so you can change it so um, say for the example so let's just change that background really quick um, you know we want to change it to a plain background so what you do is you come out of there and you push uh, color select a color um, say you want it just for for now just so you can see what's going on you want it green and say you want that bigger all you have to do is come here and push um, push that that that'll be like the mountain and then you'll push this um, First, you push that back one. That'll be the black background here. You come here and push this. This will be the mountain. Sorry, guys. I forgot to add that you need to push to make it bigger. Push this uh, chain here on top here. So push that again. So there, it's clicking. Everything it's getting all of the the words and everything here on here. And then you can just blow it up. Just move it with your thumbs here. And there, it makes it bigger for you. And then make sure you click off of the chain link here. That way you can mess with it and change all the colors if you want that to be different. Um, let me see here. Maybe you want that to be green. Um, even if you want this back part to be a different color, uh, you could change it here. Maybe you want it to be blue. Um, you know, whatever. Maybe you don't even um, want that. You can push delete. Say if you do delete it, you know it's deleting some of this stuff here. If you want to go, if you say no, I do want that, you just push the backspace there, and it fills it fills it back in for you guys. Um, here you can make Alaska bigger if you want. You could even change the font of Alaska. You don't even have to have that. You can have your own font. Just remember that when you're using um, these fonts, that um, actually, and if you watch in the course that. Um, I don't use the fonts that come with Vintage Design. I import my own fonts. So I actually have on here my own fonts that I've bought. So um, don't use the ones that come with the app. Make sure you, it's better if you buy your own. That way you know um, what you can use and what you can't use. So let me see if I can find one that I bought because. Every time they update it, they update it with these new fonts also. So there that's uh let's see here. No, I got buy that one. 
anodyne here we go this is one of my phones that i bought that i imported if you watched the video already then you would know um so anyways for an example so um there you go and so you just have a chance to um make them again here if you're in this spot right here let me see here um i mean you just it just you don't need to if you don't want to save that don't save it um and then it'll bring you back here if you want to start a new design here's something new that they added um where you can put in your custom um height and width before in the video if you watch me um i'm taking some of those you might have to do it for the one i showed you for the if you choose the custom template it's not the right size so you might have to save it and then go to the over app and resize it which is fine but now they come up with a new thing where you can change it and you can make it your own so you know you could change it to the merch size and I've already tried this um, it works perfect um, you can make your own you can do as soon as you make a design from here um, all you have to do is I'll just show you for an example. Um, say you made a design, and all you need to do is uh, so once you select the right hand corner, the top button, so make sure you select export without background right there. And then it'll, and then all you do is push is push save image right here. Push it right there. It downloads to your um, your camera roll, and then you can go to um, Am merch by Amazon. On your phone and you can um, find that file and you can upload it directly to uh, merch by Amazon and so it's that simple and that is something that I wish they would have done a long time ago but they just recently came out with that so um, that'll help us greatly when we're making our designs and so that's all but here I want to show you just a little uh, simple thing that I've learned recently I actually saw this design um, on Etsy I was looking for designs researching and I saw this design I'm like wow man that's a cool a cool design you know and so I thought I'd share it with you guys and um, just through using this app here and what you do is step one is you come to badges and then you come and you find you a shape you can whether you use vintage circles uh, vintage shapes vintage frames anything here um, I'm gonna just do start with vintage circles so what you do is you come to Vintage Circles, you um, select one of these. It could be a plain one, uh, like a circle one here. So I'm going to find like a circles, one of these here, um, just for the example. I'm going to use this one for an example. And what you do is you come here, you find this first. You get your circle down. The next one, you go back into Badges and you push backspace and you come down here the next part part two is you find a burst so you come down here and you find one of these bursts that you like um, I really, really like this one so what you do is you come and you go right there and then the next step is hold on let me make this a little bit smaller just for a second there we go um, the next step is you find you um, whether you import your graphics um, you know from the sites that you bought that's what I do I'm just gonna use an example here from one of these um, graphics here let me see here you can use an animal let me see here let's pick a, let's pick a pig here so you make the pig, you know, make it what you want. Here you go. And then and then after that, you just type in your font, you know, whatever you want that to be. I'll show you here. Just a girl. Come up here. You can make it white. Um. Another thing you can do is come here to decoration, come down here to dividers, pick one of these dividers here to put around it. Um, I always, I really like this one, so I'm gonna pick this one here. So 
So actually you could change change this text around here. So you guys are actually getting to see me do this live or not live, but you know, just how we're doing it here. Just a girl and then you wanted to add some more this uh, this is a kind of like a design that I saw like I said from Etsy and um and I really like the way that they did it and so um this is just a little bit different. I changed it up, but um you know, anybody could do this. Just a girl who loves and then you can make it uh leave it white but you can go to edit and come over here to outline outline it in red blow it up really cool like that uh, you could even make this shape right here bring it up like this all right and then you can do this who loves let's copy that duplicate it and then um, you could just her pigs yeah something like that you could do something like that or you can do um, you can delete that you can come over here to decorations again and you come up to ribbons and you can find um, you know one of these here type in here and um, can do that and then just copy that again I think you could put in pigs. Or you could change the um oops, sorry. I'm just making all this on the fly so so you guys can just get a you know you know just to see how what you can do you know so there you go you can upload that just a girl who loves her pigs you know something really simple easy to do really simple steps the first one you go find you a shape um, whether that be a circle or you know anything you know a square or a triangle then you go find a burst to stick in there and then after that you go find you some text and then you know find some little uh, things you know it doesn't have to be this um, this thing here you can go to decorations here you can come to these swirls you know find some cool cool swirls that you can add to it you know add to the sides of it you know you can put one here and you know put it over here and then duplicate it I really like the duplicated tool if you didn't know it flip it you know, make sure it's all even. Um, you know, probably needs a little bit of work, but the only reason I do du duplicate it is because I want to keep it the same um, shape and everything, the same size. So there, there you go. It's you know, simple designs like that. You know, that can sell. You know, so um, it's really simple to do. You know, if you don't like that, you can always change the colors, of course. You know, maybe you want to do pink. You just come through here and you just change the color. Really simple. Oops. So there you go. I hope you enjoyed this little tutorial, tutorial and update and um you know, it's just something you can do extra, you know, really easy to make the designs. And so it just makes it look better when you add more things to it. And when you add little, little things here, like that banner thing, and, you know, even in here, you could 
do an you know come over here and you can add like a shadow if you wanted you know you can make a black shadow or something and come here you know you could you know you just you just do whatever you whatever you want whatever you want to add to it that's all you have to do so it's really simple i hope you guys enjoy that how about maybe for just a girl here we add up a, a white um outline too If that works here. There you go. You know, just it's just something extra. You know, you don't have to do it. It's just something for fun. So, and all these words can be arranged in whatever way that you want. So, um, I hope you enjoyed that video. Again, if you haven't seen the course, I explain everything of like how to import fonts, how to, um, you know, get in designs and I just go through the whole thing, um, how to do everything. It's like an hour and 15 minute video, but it's worth watching if you just want to learn how to make designs on your phone. Um, easy. I show you how to upload them, how to put them on Amazon, everything you need to know how to do everything from your phone, you know, so hope you enjoyed that guys. And, um, I will talk to you guys later in the next video. Y'all have a great day.